So I'm Brock Hogrood. I'm from Lake Nebagam, Wisconsin, and uh, I'm a fishing guide out here on the Brule River. I, uh, I started fishing about four years ago. Uh, one day I was on Instagram and I saw a guy holding a big brown trout and said he was on the Brule River and I thought I grew up right by the Brule River and my parents live right by there. So I figured I'd uh, give it a try. So I went on Craigslist, found a fly rod, Nothing special, it's about forty dollars. Went and picked it up and uh, got after it and ever since then I've just kind of been going all out with it. My first encounter with the steelhead was my first fall and I hooked what I thought was a decent sized trout and it just started screaming out drag off my reel and I had no clue what I was hooked into. So Bought it for a couple minutes, got it in the net, saw that it was a steelhead, and just was addicted ever since. The colors that they have in the fall, they come in and they're bright chrome, and then they've been in the river for a while and they get, you know, a nice pink stripe, and the males get kind of a dark red, blood, blood red stripe right down the middle, and I think it just looks awesome. All right, out here on the Brule River today, Right away, probably first five minutes, got into this nice, fresh, big female steelhead. I think fought like a champ. I'm gonna go ahead and let her go here. Beautiful fish. There she goes. Awesome. So with steelheading, I fish all different ways. I like to fly fish, indicate, and nymph. I like to break out the center pin and throw a bobber with an egg sack underneath, even the, the spinning rod and reel, and throw some spoons or some spinners around. Uh, drift fishing, pretty much any way to fish for steelhead, I like it. And you know, some people think you should only fly fish or fish a certain way, and. You know, I don't really care about that. I think you should fish whatever way you want to fish. And any way you want to fish, I can guide you and hopefully get you on some fish and teach you about the beautiful Brule River we have here and the awesome wild fishery it is.